broadcasting on 104.6 FM, this is BBC Radio Surrey. News. Thank you very much. Good afternoon. No major problems to report as of yet on the M25, M23, the M3 or the A3. But some areas where you might get held up today, the A3 to A323, can't get the words out this afternoon, allow for delays. Work commenced there for safety barrier work for one week. And also Line Lane in Thorpe, they're doing some bridge maintenance there for one week, so do watch out for that. The A325 Ruckleton Road in Farnham, ongoing junction improvements there with temporary traffic signals. And the A286 Grayswood Road, they're doing some footwork there with temporary traffic signals. And on to public transport now on London Underground, some delays this afternoon on the Bakerloo, the Central and Victoria lines. But no reported problems on uh, British Rail or the local bus this afternoon. Christina King, BBC Radio Surrey, Travel News on 104.6 FM. Thank you, Brett. If you want a regular mix of news, information and conversation, there's only one place to be, here on 104.6 FM. BBC Radio Surrey bring you the news from around the world and from around the corner and conversation with Surrey people for Surrey people. BBC Radio Surrey, 104.6 FM. And on to the top news story today. BBC Radio Surrey in the evening with Claire Paul. BBC Radio Surrey. Sport. And the latest sports news from Philippa Beaumont. Totally true. It's when you use the tea towel. BBC Radio Surrey in the evening with Claire Paul. That's your lot from us two tonight. The Terrible Twins back again. Five past four tomorrow for the final one of the week. It's the 13th of... of what is it, 13th? And thank you very much of December. Slightly confused here. It's the flu. Fluitis has set in. So don't walk on any ladders tomorrow. Thanks to Sean for the news, for Philippa for the sport, and to Christina for the travel. And to me, because I did a bit as well. <laughs> Not much. I'll see you tomorrow at five past four. Bye-bye. Saturday with Steve Watts. Yes, we're here. It's the 14th of December. Welcome with you between now and one this afternoon. Today, what are we doing? Well, sharing his ideal weekend with us this week, it's the Mayor of Woking, Dick Williams. Also, later on, we're finding out about Christmas Cracker. That's a new thing that's hitting Cobham today. And Gary Murray from the Blue Zoogie Band, he'll be popping in to tell us about this new sort of music that's hitting Surrey by storm. Of course, the phone lines are open all throughout the programme. 0483... Three oh double six double six. That's the number if you want to take part in the Wattsies What's It, the incredibly devious quiz, some good prizes this morning. If you want to have a mention, just say hello or tell us about your event. Oh four eight three three oh double six double six. Give us a call right now. BBC Radio Surrey at lunchtime with Steve Watts. Join me between 6 and 9 every morning on this frequency, 104.6 FM, for BBC Radio Surrey's John Terrett Breakfast Programme. For the first time in the county, you can hear real people in the early morning. Newsmakers and opinion formers appear throughout the programme to give the best overall assessment of the day ahead. Christina King provides the latest travel every 15 minutes. The John Terrett Breakfast Programme, 6 to 9, Monday to Friday. And that's about it from this evening's... 
Drive time from Radio Surrey is sitting here wondering what on earth I've been doing for the last three hours for a moment there. Charles Carroll with you for the last three hours. Tomorrow, Claire Paul will be back. She's finished going off doing whatever it is she's been doing. It's been great mystery around this place. What has Claire Paul been up to? But she will definitely be back with Drive Time at four o'clock on the dot tomorrow afternoon from BBC Radio Surrey. From me, Charles Carroll, good night. Miranda Birch on BBC Radio Surrey, Monday to Friday, 2 till 4. What's on on BBC Radio Surrey? This on BBC Radio Surrey, Broadcasting House, Guildford, GU2 5AP. Steve Watts on BBC Radio Surrey. Well, noon between 4 and 7, join me here at BBC Radio Surrey on 104.6 FM. I'll take you through the news of the day in the county, and we'll take a look at national and international issues as well. Put that together with up-to-the-minute travel news every 15 minutes, and you'll be able to hear the very best diet of news and information for Surrey. 4 till 7, every weekday, 104.6 FM, with me, Claire Paul. Yes, and be warned, she's a hard woman. If you're not going to be there, you must send a note. <laughs> Radio Surrey with Nick Simmons. Sunday morning on BBC Radio Surrey, Sunday the 22nd of December. Christmas is just around the corner. Nick Simmons. the job of getting you from A to B very seriously, which is why we offer you the best travel service around. I'm Christina King and weekday mornings between 6 and 9 and in the afternoons from 4 to 7, I bring you travel news every 15 minutes with road, rail, bus and airport information. And during the rest of the day and at weekends, there's travel on the hour from our friends at AA Roadwatch. BBC Radio Surrey Travel News. Simply the best on 104.6 FM. Sorry, the three hours of music and conversation. As always, we'll be taking a look at an interesting leisure area and maybe getting you started off in a brand new hobby. There's a look at the day's historical and musical anniversaries, some fine music and our competition as well. All that between 9 and 12 this Sunday morning on 104.6 FM. Please join me best yes. this week as we stand on the verge of a new year we ask are you doing the right thing with your life we hear the hopes of an expert on europe for 1992 we look at the challenge of aids over the coming year and we meet a woman magistrate who's at the forefront of the fight against juvenile crime all that and more this sunday morning between seven and nine so make a date with me margaret collingwood on 104.6 fm for sunday best Mike Buckingham on BBC Radio Surrey. Call now on 0273 570057. Radio Surrey. The BBC in Surrey, 104.6 FM. As the market closes, we bring you the latest news from the city. BBC Radio Surrey's Drive Time, first for finance. BBC in your county on 104.6 FM. Stuart McIntosh on BBC Radio Surrey, 104.6 FM. One oh four point six FM, BBC Radio Surrey.
BBC Radio Surrey in the afternoon with Claire Paul. BBC Radio Surrey. News is our business. Rebecca Dalton, BBC Radio Surrey News at Brooklyn's Museum. Sean Curran, BBC Radio Surrey News, Lingfield. Isabel Eaton, BBC Radio Surrey News, Woking. Frederick Rostand, BBC Radio Surrey News, Hazelmere. The BBC in Surrey on 104.6 FM. News is our business. BBC Radio Surrey. News is our business. Isabel Eaton, BBC Radio Surrey News, Caterham. This is Becky Milligan for BBC Radio Surrey News in Rygate. Frederick Rostand, BBC Radio Surrey News, Camberley. Kate Harding, BBC Radio Surrey News, Dorking. The BBC in Surrey on 104.6 FM. News is our business. publicity for your event. One, shout from the nearest mountain. Two, write your message across the sky. Or three, use BBC Radio Surrey's What's On service. It's not nearly as dangerous and frankly it's less likely to leave you short of breath. So just write to What's On, BBC Radio Surrey, Broadcasting House Guildford, GU2 5AP. BBC Radio Surrey, at your service. BBC Radio Surrey, travel news. On the roads this evening, the M25 remains rather slow on the clockwise carriageway. That's at Junction 8 at Rygate following an earlier accident. Just one cancellation on the trains this morning. That's the 6.15 from Weybridge to Waterloo. Local buses in and out of Guildford. Rygate and Leatherhead bus stations are all running to time. On to flight news. No problems at Gatwick, but there is one delay into Heathrow. That's the BA174 from New York. BBC Radio Surrey Travel News. Simply the best. On 104.6 FM. Hello, this is Stuart McIntosh. Don't forget to be with me for spare time this and every Saturday from 7 until 10. Spare time is gardening, cooking, cars and motoring, and DIY. Not forgetting the events from the diary, the music, and me, here on BBC Radio Surrey. BBC Radio Surrey, with Claire Paul. Paul on BBC Radio Surrey. Well, it's a cloudy, misty old start to the day, and I'm afraid it's not going to get any better, as you heard, so you better settle down to the, at least the next 50 minutes here on 104.6 FM and listen to some of the topics we have for you between now and nine, including the Surrey School that is in touch with the latest space shuttle mission. Our election coverage will include a visit to the Woking constituency, and we find out why a Surrey School is carrying out random drug searches on its pupils. BBC Radio Surrey in the morning with John Terrett. Also, Kingston Anisha Health Authority is publishing its annual report today. I'll be talking to one of their top people about exactly what they sort of year they've had. First of the news headlines, those come from Judith Dingley. Min Jeff Draper on BBC Radio Surrey. Call now on 0273 570057. What's on?
Am I bitter? Certainly not. Uh, the Surrey Archaeological Society have a lecture on aspects of Saxon Surrey, uh, Saxon sculpture and illuminated manuscripts at the Christian Centre in Dorking, 8 o'clock this evening, if you fancy that. Uh, the Surrey Federation of the Women's Institute have an art exhibition at Bourne Hall in Yule. Uh, Breakthrough, the deaf and hearing people have their mobile advisory service behind Gateway's car park in Fleet between 2 and 4 this afternoon. What else? The Parasol Children's Theatre presents Alice in Wonderland at the Redgrave at Farnham tonight. And at the Harlequin in Red Hill, the Baron Knight Show is on there at 8 o'clock. Tickets on the box office number, which is 0737 765547. BBC Radio Surrey, 104.6 FM. BBC Radio Surrey, Finance. Hello, this is Nick Simmons, and I hope you can join me this Sunday morning here on BBC Radio Surrey between 9 and 12. We'll be having another in our series on the National Trust when I'll be visiting Hatchland's house near Guildford. We'll be at the Surrey Young Farmers Cow Pie Rally at Cranley. Tony Gorham will be updating us on a sports scene in our disabled feature, Fit and Well. Plus news on our Bike to the Future competition. We'll also have our regular features, Where Am I? The What's On? On This Day in History and a look at the Sunday papers, plus travel, weather and some good music as well. So join me, Nick Simmons, Sharon Lewis and David Bailey this Sunday morning at nine here on BBC Radio Surrey. Stuart McIntosh on BBC Radio Surrey, 104.6 FM. Call Steve now on 0483 306666. Call Steve Watts on 0483 306666. The weekend starts here with Steve Watts on BBC Radio Surrey. BBC Radio Surrey, 104.6 FM. BBC Radio Surrey. Sport. Much more to say on BBC Radio Surrey with Julian Clegg, Monday to Friday, 9 till 12. If you've got something to say, then say it to Julian Clegg, Monday to Friday, 9 till 12, on BBC Radio Surrey. You can talk to him now on 0273 570057. He's waiting to hear from you. Radio Surrey's Helpline. We urgently need volunteers to help give our physically disabled guests a holiday. We ask the volunteers to come along for a one or two week residential period to our specially designed and equipped centre at South Knopfield, which is just outside Red Hill. Now, you've got something to offer. Yes, um, we have. Chairs, I believe. Chairs, that's right. They are uh, metal tubular chairs, uh, stacking types with canvas seats and canvas backs and they're in good condition. We broadcast the helpline each weekday lunchtime between midday and one. If you're looking for help or you have it to offer, write to this address. Helpline, BBC Radio Surrey, Broadcasting House, Guildford, GU2 5AP. BBC Radio Surrey's Helpline, at your service on 104.6 FM. We'll... BBC in your county on 104.6 FM.